culture is the essence of our humanity. It is everything we do but don't have to. It is the difference between grapes and wine and between silicon chips and sand. Culture is all of the information that we transmit through non-genetic means. Yet those bits and pieces of information that we transmit, well, not all of them are actually transmitted into the future. Some of them you know, have higher resonance. Some of them make it through the ages and break the barriers of space, time and language. These are the paintings of Michelangelo, the moonwalk of Neil Armstrong. The Observatory of Global Culture is our effort to collect, analyze, visualize and distribute data on cultural achievements. The data for the Observatory of Global Culture is the result of a careful curation process. We've collected over 11,000 biographies, present in the largest number of languages on Wikipedia, with their place of birth, date of birth, and a normalized classification of cultural domains. This allows us to observe the cultural achievements that have broken cultural, linguistic, and geographic barriers. For example, Faraday, Maxwell, and Tesla proxy the development of electromagnetism, whereas Chaplin, Spielberg, and Kurosawa proxy the development of film. The Observatory of Global Culture is a data visualization engine designed to help you explore this data through a suite of interactive visualizations. You can ask questions like, what are the cultural exports of Japan? Or, how do the cultural exports of France compare to those of Germany? Our development stack leverages modern web technologies, including the Meteor web framework on top of MongoDB. Our frontend is powered by D3+, an extension to the popular D3 library. The observatory page includes tree maps, matrices, scatter plots, and thematic maps. It includes all of the controls needed to adjust and select visualizations. This and other pages allow you to explore the different dimensions of culture. Culture spreads through words, through music, through text and narratives. As a result, our world is full of ghosts. The ghost of Janis Joplin lives in her music, just like the ghost of Alan Turing lives on every computer machine. These are not the ghosts that roam around with blankets, but these are ghosts that are made of information. The Observatory of Global Culture is an effort to celebrate these ghosts. These are the ghosts that are made of information and that are embedded in everything we hear and on everything we touch.